the legendary dragon talent trainer versus the leader of the venom wars was straight up fire and i mean that literally that fight was straight up hate. as you guys can probably tell by now this update theme is really revolved around the dragon rework i mean every single part of this update down to little details is just a dragon theme and i actually really like that and introducing the new dragon talent dojo area where uzoth might teach you a couple things about the dragon talent fighter style that you guys didn't know before also i bet you guys didn't expect the diamond and chop rework either huh reworks aside let's talk about the two crazy new weapons that got added to the game and let's get straight to it all right so the first weapon i want to show you guys is the amazing dragon heart which is the newest sword in the game with the cleanest this weapon model there is i'm telling you guys this weapon model is insane go check it out close up right here close up of the weapon model got some crazy vfx on it as well all right so first off i'm gonna show you guys the z move which is the conic blitz here we go z move this is how it looks like when you charge it and here we go Yo, this gets me hyped every time I see it. Next up, we have the X move, which is Infernal Catastrophe. All right. So this one right here. I don't even have to explain nothing. Y'all can see it right here. It is a big nuke. Boom. Look at that. When you shoot this thing against the surface, look at the explosion and the impact. Boom. And again. That's it for the X move. And then next up, we have the M1s. Let's check out the M1s real quick. Looking very nice. Next up, I'm going to showcase the newest gun in the game, which is Dragon Storm. Look at this HD high quality model. 
Modeler cooked on this. Actually, one of the most clean models I've ever seen on this platform. Let's get straight to the M1s. All right, here we go. This thing is fast. It's a Gatling gun, my boy. When you pull up, you just light them up on sight. As you guys can tell, it isn't your basic M1 where you just click and it shoots once. You can hold it. All right. So the Z move, the first version is on the ground. Here you go. That's what it looks like when you charge it. Boom. And again. Look at the range on this move. But it looks crazy. Next up, we have the other version of the Z move, which is the version when you use it in the air. All right, hold on. You jump up, hold Z, spread your wings, and boom. You guys have seen it in the last video, but some of these weapons in the game have auto lock on if your mouse is close enough to that character, all right? As you guys can see, once I'm right here, it doesn't lock on. But if my mouse is in the area where my enemy is at, they auto lock on. Peep that. Peep that. And now we have the X move, which is Infernal Comet. Let me just back up a little bit. I mean, is that good enough? Nah. There we go. You get sniped with this weapon. Hold on. You are getting sniped with this weapon. The range on this is crazy. To celebrate this update, we need to fire some fireworks, my boy. All right, next up on the list is the reworked fighting style known as Dragon Talon. All right, peep the VFX in the hand. The new fire animation. Time to show off the M1s. Let's get straight to it. Boom, 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 boom. So first up, we have the Z move. Peep this. Boom, that boy gone. That boy got sent to Narnia. All right, let me get him low. Because the cool thing about this Dragon Talon Z move, it has another animation when you meet a certain condition. So let me meet that real quick. Once your enemy is low health and you charge with that Z move right here, you hit him with that combo and it instant executes them. Tell me that is not sick. All y'all in the comments better be going crazy for this right now. I need to see straight W's for that. All right, so here again, I'm gonna show you guys the normal version. Boom, and again. Here's the execution one more time. Peep it. <laughs> the next up we have Ember Annihilation, which is the X move. So we didn't change it up too much, but we made it better. Trust me on this. All right, peep this. As you guys can see, you can still control the dragon, but the VFX got improved a lot. Look at this. Boom. Drag him. Yup. Come here. Boom. All right, that's gonna be it for the X move. Spike. There's another version of the X move when you hold the X. Watch. You can go on the dragon yourself. You can ride the dragon. Pause. But anyways. Boom. Yes, sir. And then next up, we have the Infernal Vortex, which is a C move. All right, and you guys are gonna see, this move is actually insane. Boom. So you drag him up to the air and slam him back down. Boom. Boom. Let me know your thoughts on the new Dragon Talon. Let me know what you guys think about the new weapons as well. 
and let's get straight to the reworks all right so the first rework is the new reworked blade fruit it was also previously known as chop but it got chopped away and got replaced by the blade fruit here we go here's the m1s Bom, 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 bom. All right, first up, we have the Z move, which is Razor Cyclone and Peep That Charge animation. Boom! Next up, we have Blade Dance. If you like spinning to win, this is your move to go. And again. And again. And one more time, because you can use this in the air too. And now let's use the C move, which is called Saw Shredder. Here we go. Boom. For a low tier fruit, this fruit is actually way too good. All right, and then we have the F move, which is Turbine Flight. And you gone. You are gone. Last but not least, the passives. I'm immune to all swords still. As you guys know, previously the fruit was also immune to swords, but now it has a nice little animation to it. Hit me with the X move. Nope. Nope. immune to every single move as long as it's by a sword next up we have the diamond rework all right here we go i look goofy with this hold on all right now that i hacked into rip Ender's account first up we have the transformation which is the z move all right cool thing is when you transform to diamond it also damages them by a little bit and then if you hold z you untransform boom untransform the reason why you hold the z move to untransform is because the z move is an actual move while you're transformed all right think about that there it is all right that's gonna be it for the z move next up we have the x move which is known as shard storm here we go that boy will get lit up Let's go on to the C move, which is Shimmering Disruption. Boom! The craziest move of this kit. So here we go. You are not safe. You are getting hit no matter where you go. Again. There we go. Alright guys, that's gonna be it for this showcase and I hope you guys enjoyed the amazing new weapons and reworks that were shown. Again, keep in mind this is only the second trailer and the third trailer will be the final trailer for this update. And as you guys all know, this one's gonna show the incredible dragon rework that everyone has been waiting for. And if you guys thought the stuff you saw in this trailer was crazy, then just wait. This final trailer is gonna blow y'all's mind. I'm telling y'all. The trailer will premiere on the 12th of December, which is coming up very soon. Not only that, we'll also show you the release date of the dragon update so make sure you turn on your notification i'll see you guys on the 12th peace